Okay, so um, unfortunately they're working on the house across the street, so you might hear that a little bit, but hopefully it won't be too overwhelming or anything like that. So yeah, here it is. I uh, just came today. Oh, dirt in the package. Yep. BBJ, P, everything. There's the Amazon logo underneath the stickers. Already got the address off there. And, uh, yep, so there is the, well, front, I suppose. And this is the back. Pull to open. Save this resealable bag for returns. Items must be returned to the original packaging, including hangers, poly bags. Jeez. Interesting. Amazon logo there, and then it's just nothing. I don't think there's just a just a barcode there. Yeah. This side, anything? Just another barcode. Nothing on the top. Bottom. Cycle logo. M3 BMW. <laughs> and another barcode. Alright, so let me grab my knife here. Oh, crap. It always likes to go inside there, and then, like, you can't get it out unless you have, like, really long nails. Anyway, so the box isn't over here, so I'll open it. Over there. Right. So here we are to the actual box. Ooh, here we go. Oh yeah. There we go. Sanjin HDR15. HD radio, FM RDS, and AM. <laughs> it's just, let's <laughs> AM. You know, <laughs> clock radio, HD radio, and then there's nothing on WXYG. Er, ec oh, I guess with the, yeah, without the Z it's G, which is a station out around here, but WXYZ, there's nothing there just fake. That's just a fake radio station they put on there. Just the Sanjin logo on the bottom. Top. Flip it around. Oh man. Look at that, huh? HR15, everything. It's got an auxiliary too that'll come in handy. Uh, what does that mean? Stereo, like you can connect headphones to it? That's kind of cool. Auto scan, all like seek and stuff. Okay. Real time. Oh, <laughs> it actually keeps time. Well, that's, that's useful. <laughs> <laughs> Buzzer alarm, radio alarm, cool, cool. Sleep timer, nice. Although I typically just leave uh, classical on all night. In that case, I get up and don't have to go over there and touch it. Um. But yeah, there's all the uh, info. If you want to read that, you can pause it, obviously. Sanjin logo and their QR codes as well. Record out. Oh, that's just. Is that not the same thing? Headphone? Wait, really? Does it have a USB socket for charging stuff? That would come in real handy. Cool. On the back, just some gibberish there, I think. Yeah, and that's just the bottom of the box. Uh, did we go through everything? Oh, sides. Okay, so it's got a photo of it on there. Oh, the size of the light range. So, and then over here, it's got the QR code and then another photo of it, and like the model name and stuff. So I say we open it. Damn it. Focus. Yay. Okay. 
I might want two hands for this. There we go. Look at that, huh? So there's the manual. And there's the machine itself. Okay, I'm gonna set this kind of aside. Eh, uh, jeez. Okay, we'll set it on top of the radio DJ, I guess. <laughs> Here we go. So... Right, there's that. I'll just kind of go through it all quickly here. You can pause and read, or go in point two twenty-five. Oop, or go in uh, Jesus, or go in quarter speed, so that way it's easier to pause. Do do do. There you go. Oops. Do do do. do. It's a lot of the same stuff as uh the HDR fourteen, I suppose, too. It's a lot of the same stuff. A lot of the same controls and stuff. I, yes. And this one I'll actually use every day though. This is going to be awesome. That, you know, I have of course the HDR 14. You know, I don't use it every day though. I really only use it for like, you know, special occasions and stuff, you know. It's nice when I go places, but I want one, you know, yeah, like a clock one that I can just set on my nightstand there and use every day and night. And then there's that, and then it just repeats itself in Spanish. Okay. There's the limited warranty info. Cool. Okay, so now we'll set that. Uh, I'll just set that up here there with you. <coughs> I'll put it back in the box when I'm done. Okay, so what is this? Is this like the power adapter, which I'll actually use? I don't actually use the power adapter for the HDR 40. <laughs> just use the batteries. Because it's just it's much easier. And I have rechargeable ones, so... Oh no, I don't... Ah, I'm ripping the box, oh no. Ah, it's not too bad. Okay. Oh yeah, look at that. Ooh. Nice material. It's high quality. I like how they kind of packaged it in there. It's like flush with that there. Okay. Anyway. So. There that is. And there's like the wattage and stuff for that. Uh, oh. Okay. And then they just got a little cardboard insert there. We'll insert that back in. Okay. Right about there. It's just white. It's got one of those things on it. And then there it is. Uh, so what is it? Is it... Oh, 6 volts. So it's a The HR14, I think, is only 5 volts. So, a little bit higher wattage. Put that back. And then here we have the unit itself. And it's in this... Nice, like, cloth protection, like the HDR14 was. There we go. Oh, I'll be damned. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's glossy again. <laughs> Gosh. All right, I'm just going to set that over there again. I doubt there's anything more in there. There, it's glossy again. Get a good look. Oh, there's already a fingerprint. I don't even think I put that on there. Maybe I did. Yeah, cause that is not going to look like that anymore. I guarantee you. Look at that. Even the sticker's glossy. That is nice, nice, nice. 
Also, I really didn't even see that many videos about this on YouTube. I mean, I saw there was just one guy doing a band scan, um, but he didn't even like really go over the features of the radio. Um, but yeah, ooh. he's got like rubber feet and stuff. That is good crap, dude. All right, so yes, it does have a USB port for charging. Oh, and I suppose that might be why it's higher voltage, too. But, yep, and then it's got the DC in there, and then the antenna here for the FM. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, the tuning's on the snooze thing. Huh, interesting. Granted, you, I won't be using that much, because I'll just be using the preset, but... Band, HD Seek, and the auto program. Three alarms, wow. Nap? Was that just like a temporary alarm or something? Sleep timer? And the menu info button, of course. HD radio. Select, that must be for the menu. And power button, of course. Band, obviously. Speaker there, that's a pretty big speaker for an alarm clock, huh? And then nothing on that side. Over here we have our volume knob. Oh, look at that, actually. It's just, like, smooth. Oh, and it's clicky. Oh, man, I'm jealous. Well, not jealous, actually, because it's mine, but... <laughs> Record out. What is that? What's the diff... I don't know. I don't know what the difference is between that and the headphone jack. And then the auxiliary, and obviously... I don't know what the record out is. I'll have to maybe do some more looking into that. I guess just that way, like, the headphone jacks... Maybe, I guess, if you were to connect something to the record out, it would keep the speaker on, and it wouldn't be um, affected by the volume control, what's coming out of there, versus the headphone jack. I don't know, but why would you use that? I don't know. Okay. Anyway, yeah, there's the uh, info, too. Alright, so I, instead of doing it like I did the HDR14, I'm actually going to go set it up where I'm going to have it, and then we'll program the stuff instead of doing it here where I can't receive a single thing, so. Alright. Okay, so I shut my windows, hopefully you won't be able to hear them as much. I'm also just using the built-in mic on my iPad. was using uh, my headphone phone, but since we're going to be listening to this as well, I just figured we may as well uh, just go with the built-in one. So, welcome to HD Radio, just like it says in the sand engine. Okay, cool. FM band. It's probably tuned to 875. Yeah. I'll take volumes over here. Oh my god, I'm jealous. I'm not jealous. I'm, I'm, uh, I don't know what you'd say. In love. <laughs> Let me, I guess you can't really kind of bring it closer. So does this have pages? Oh. oh, interesting. So it doesn't have pages. Cool, cool, cool. So they filled one with that, two with that. Why are they all... They're all even. Oh, except for this one, I suppose. Wait, what was that? Oh. Okay, so we'll start with our first stations here. We will go with uh, 92.1. Oh, wait. I didn't put up the antenna. Okay, I'm going to put up the antenna and then we'll start again. Er, yeah, right here. Right, we're back. So they got the uh, Twins game on. Preset store on one. Okay. Then we'll go. Yep, it's getting it. What? Oh, wait, did it not save it?
Oh, what? How, why is it, why isn't it saving it? Did it save it there? No, it didn't. What? Ah, crap. Oh, wait. I think I know what to do. Select, I bet. Yelp. And I can always relocate the antenna to get better signal, too. I just put it up at the closest place I found. So then, number two. There we go. And then next one... Okay. There we go. And then here we'll get our first HD station. Nice. For the HD kick in there. Alright. Now... I don't know that song. Yeah, I think I'll probably have to relocate the antenna. I don't think this is quite the best place for it. Yeah, that's pretty uh hard to make out. That is it is fringe, but I suppose, and then I'll do 105.9, even though that probably won't come in here at all. Okay. Now we'll go to our number two stations. Uh, yeah, we'll just have to loop around here. Our NPR stations. Not getting the HD. Interesting. Weird. Alright, and then... Should we do... Nah. Let's do there. That's not one to come in here. That's fringe as well. It's basically just a copy of uh, that station, though, so it's not a big deal. That one doesn't come in. Except for their HD signal. They have more HD subchannels that aren't on the other one, unfortunately. And then we got classical. Okay. Then we'll go with uh, my channels. What? Um, I don't know what's going on there. RDSP11. What? Is that something with like the emergency alerts or something? I don't know. Let's look further into that. But let's say it'll actually be easier to go this way. Oh, wait. Are we going to get their HD? Maybe I could get their HD because then I, uh, I am interested in listening to one of their sub channels. It's like news talk, but uh, yeah. Anyway, we will now go to my channels, my FM, my FM transmitter here. I haven't got this going yet today, so it's just silence, but I 
Uh, right, I didn't get the last one. So I'll have to go back there. Should be 12. There we go. So now we'll just make sure, I suppose. Jeez, empty. So now we'll go to the AM band. Okay. What are the presets on here? Um, 1400, eh? Probably won't get that, huh, unfortunately. Okay. So first, I suppose, we'll start with good stations, right, the country ones, damn it, oh, scanning, cool, this one's pretty quiet, 1430, what is that, KNSP, ooh, it is actually there slightly, I can hear it anyway, anyway, reset, one. Okay. Then. Well, I suppose that's the only one. And then uh, we're starting off at the beginning of the band. So actually, I'll just go. Oh, there. This should come in no problem here. These are pretty good. I suppose it's also got my charger right next to it, though, so it's also right here. So, it's also having some issues there. WCCO. Let me actually move my charger if I can here. KLTO. I suppose, yeah, CBW, huh? I was like confused because it said that too. <laughs> okay. Cancel. Awesome. Uh, then we'll go WJON. Side. Although I'll also get it on KZBK HD too, so I don't know how. <laughs> Probably won't listen to their AM signal that often, but program it anyway. And then I think that should be it. Um, as far as. Oh, well, and then uh, Radio DJ. There we go. Now we'll just make sure on here. No, it's not that. Okay. Yep. 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 Okay. So it's quite possible I missed another one. Oh, I did. I missed K-Talk. You know what? I'll get that off video. This video is already long enough. All right, hope you enjoyed. And uh, yeah, this is, oh, I better set the clock though too. Okay, let's set the clock. Mm -hmm. Set time. Let's see what time is it? One fifty-five. Oh wait, can I have a twenty-four hour clock though? Because I thought I could on my uh, other one. Yeah.
What now? Oh my gosh. Might be better to do this off camera too. But. No. Okay, I think I know what I gotta do now. There we go. Yes, we want the 24 hour clock. Okay. So then. It is. 13. 55 or 56 set date it is 5 1 2021 okay there I hope you enjoyed and uh yes i'll see you in the next one i'll move the antenna around to get better fm reception and whoa <laughs> that is so cool all right oh wait what a oh okay and then the band you also use just like the ox okay cool <laughs> oh and it goes dim if you have it off too interesting